if I would bring my children here um, to stay. We first met the general manager of the Valley West Inn, Jennifer Mason, back in May after the fire department inspection. I didn't realize it would be 200 violations, but we acted quickly on them. A few weeks later, the police department was approached by a former tenant who alleged Mason used her access to the tenant's debit card number and charged $1,960 to her card based on damage Mason felt had been done to the room. Police say Mason did not get any quotes or estimates from businesses or contractors, nor did she contact the former tenant about these charges. Just because you have someone's credit card number doesn't mean you can just indis indiscriminately start charging their card for uh, estimates of damage to, uh, to the room, in this case, when you have nothing to base that on. In the report, a West Des Moines officer states he asked Mason if she had a total value of the damage before she charged the former tenant's debit card. Mason answered, no, but if we took too much money from her account, we will refund it when we know exactly how much the damages are. Mason also told officers, if I wait to get my money from these types of people, I will never get it. Today, Mason told KCCI the room was trashed by this tenant who went to police and she felt comfortable with her own estimates because she knows exactly how much everything in the rooms cost to be repaired, cleaned or replaced because she has to do it so often.